with the growth of the SME sector being looked at by the government, increasing job opportunities based on technical skills is important. They should come with the establishment of training facilities and institutions for Papua New Guineans. Shay Scovel of the Manufacturers Council of PNG said, with the current economic boom propelled by the PNG LNG project and other emerging industrial activities, there is need to train more people in technical skills for sustainable development. Simply is to provide a platform that's conducive for doing business. So we need to address all of the transport infrastructure issues. We need to make sure that we have a human resource development. We need, and that, that's uh, across the board from technical skills. We have a real, real problem with the National Training Council and all of these government bodies at the moment. There's just an abundance of people doing soft training. You know, we, we, we do not need more bookkeepers and, uh, and more quasi-accountants in Papua New Guinea. What we need is people who are trained in technical skills which are in demand in Papua New Guinea. It's one of the issues. We, we see it all the time. You know, we have a big contract or a small contract here and we bring in foreign labour and everybody says, oh, why are we bringing in foreigners? And then we find out there is nobody in Papua New Guinea qualified to do the job and the, and the very few Papua New Guineans who are qualified to do that job, they don't want to come and do it in Papua New Guinea. They're working over in China or in Australia, in Western Australia, in other places doing this work and even though they're getting paid well to do those jobs here in Papua New Guinea they don't want to return. So we, across the board we need to make some serious steps to reforming the way we deliver technical training, the way we incentivise businesses, that's SME development in themselves. He added that the government should plan well in order to implement its policies. I think this year was the year of implementation, perhaps it might have been better put as the year of planning for implementation because it's not really realistic to get all the work done. There's just so many things that need to be done that it's going to take some time. So we need to, we need to focus on those value adding and downstream processing sectors because they are the backbone, they're the customers of our SME sector. The development of the SME sector will apparently involve more people with technical expertise apart from theoretical knowledge. Samuel Raitano, National MTV News.